Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel, and thanks for logging on. Today we're discussing the Jezure Lecoult Tribute to Deep Sea European Dial Special Edition. You can see this one of 959 piece limited edition and purchase it on our website. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you enjoy these videos, and please click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen at any time during the video to see our full listing for this watch with additional high resolution images and naturally full pricing details. Now the original Jezure Lecoult Deep Sea Memovox Diving Alarm came out in 1959. In 2011, the manufacturer from Le Sentier chose to pay tribute to one of its all-time legends. And while the original was produced in 1,061 copies, the reissue was only produced in 959 versions with this European dial. Now the watch is a little bit bigger than its 39mm predecessor, and on my wrist, 6 and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference, you can see that it does a great job of fooling the eye. It looks like the line for line, millimeter for millimeter image of the watch from 1959. But it is 40.5 millimeters across the round of the case. It's fairly slim at 14 millimeters thick. You can see it does have a sloped bezel and a slightly domed crystal in acrylic. So it's an easy watch to slide underneath a tight sleeve or dress cuff. All but the absolute tightest formal sleeves will have no trouble with this watch. From lug to lug, it's 49.5 millimeters, but it wears smaller than that. So it's an easy watch to live with on a smaller wrist like mine. I would say if your wrist is as small as 14 centimeters, maybe even 13 and a half in circumference, you can wear this watch with great security and a look of aesthetic proportion. Now it's not exceptionally hefty on the wrist, although it is a little heavier than you expect because of the hollow full metal case back. So there's no display case back here because it actually has a resonator. You heard the alarm and you might have been struck by just how soft it sounded. And that's because it's not optimized for use on the surface. The caliber 956 as employed in the Tribute to Deep Sea is designed to be felt more than it's heard. And underwater it has incredible vocal chops, very loud, very pronounced, hard to miss. The trade-off is this is one that you should put on your wooden desktop to get a little bit more volume or on some sort of resonator on your office desk because again, this one's designed for submarine sound, not for waking you up in the high and dry. However, the watch does give you spectacular visuals such that it'll light up your eyes even if it doesn't wake you up outright. The watch looks like the 1959 Deep Sea. Now there were two versions of that watch. The American dialed version which said Memovox and Lecoult and the European dialed version which was a little bit cleaner and said Jezure Lecoult and this version pays tribute to the European dial. There also exists an American dial tribute variant as well as three red dialed charity versions but those are unlikely to surface anytime soon. So in this case you have a watch that is the line for line detail for detail image of the original, but it has 100 meter water resistance. So unlike those vintage examples that survive, you can actually take this one in the water. Now you won't want to do it on this particular strap because although it has the look of vintage tropic straps, rubber, with perforations from the original era of issue. This one is actually an embossed calfskin, so it feels beautiful, it looks gorgeous, but you will want to put this on a rubber or textile strap before taking the plunge. It has a simple and easily adjustable and vintage representative polished steel pin buckle, so you can find a precise fit add or subtract length as activity and weather dictate. Now the dial of the watch is very simple. Like the bezel, it features an Acru Super Luminova. So the Acru designed to create a simulated radium patina look. In 1959, when this watch was issued, Jezure Lecoult was still using radium on its dials. So while those watches will still light up a Geiger counter, the luminescent elements will have been damaged by the radium over time, so those old watches will not glow. This one will, and it is spectacular because it has a fully loomed bezel as well. Now, the bezel does not rotate. Jezure Lecoult, then as now, thought that the best way to notify a diver as to the end of his dive time would be a vocal alarm. And again, this one is expressly specified for submarine sound. 268 pieces, 23 jewels under this ornate vintage style case back. The original also sported the image of a frogman with spear. So that 23 jewel automatic winding movement is a caliber 956, Jezure Lecoult's most modern alarm caliber, equipped with 23 jewels, ceramic rotor bearings, very efficient unidirectional winding. It has a 45 hour power reserve. And when you pull the crown, you can hack the balance and precisely set the watch against a known accurate reference time, such as a dive timer or atomic clock. If you love Jezure Lecoult vintage, but either for reasons of budget or simple practicality, 
you're not into buying a vintage watch, let's say you want to wear your watch and enjoy it in the water, can't do that with vintage, but you can with a vintage tribute. And when it hues this closely to the original, you simply can't lose. You can see this Jezur Lecoult Tribute to Deep Sea European Dial edition of 959 and purchase it on our website.